Well, the unemployment benefits situation is very fluid. It has been a couple of weeks since I did a video about unemployment benefits, and I have had quite a few developments. So in this video, I'm going to share with you what I have learned, what I've discovered. You know, some states, uh, people are getting benefits. Some states, people have been able to apply. And some states, people haven't even been able to apply yet. So I'm going to cover that in this video, everything unemployment insurance. And stick around, because at the end of the video, I'm going to share with you exactly how much money from the government I have received so far in benefits in my bank account. Hey, everybody. It is Jay Crater with the Rideshare Guy. Monday morning, drinking my little bit of Nespresso. And uh, let's get into it. So background. Last Monday, um, at like 1 o'clock, I went out to go right over there to check on my, my mail. The mail normally comes around 2 o'clock, but um, I had called Bank of America, and they told me my debit card for my unemployment benefits would be arriving uh, today, uh, which would last Monday or Tuesday. So at 1 o'clock, I went and I you know, checked, and then at 1.30, I went and I, I checked. <laughs> like like a little kid at Christmas time going down to see if Santa came yet. You know, but I haven't had any unemployment benefits yet. You know, it's it's one thing to have the money on the on a on a website showing in your account, but it's another thing to actually be able to take that money and somehow get it into your bank account. And in California, to do that, you need to have a debit card. So at 1:30 I said, "Screw it. I'm I'm not going to come back till 3." Show a little discipline, Jay. So I <laughs> I went out at three and, and there was an envelope from the EDD and I and I and I felt it, you know, and nothing. I didn't feel the card. My heart just sank. And then I thought, well, let me just feel all the edges. And then up in the upper right hand corner, there it was. There it was. I could feel the card. The eagle had landed. Number one. The EDD, the Employment Development Department, that's the unemployment uh, department in California, has a Bank of America debit card. So you can't get your funds out of your account until you got the debit card. So according to our survey, 57% of drivers are not driving during the pandemic. That's a lot of people. And to date, um, as of the day <laughs> I received the card, all I've received from the government was a $1,200 stimulus check and a $1,000 um, EIDL grant. And that is three months in. That's not a lot of money. So I was very excited to get the, um, the card, right? So uh, when you get the card, what you've got to do is um, go online and uh, activate the card and um, give it a PIN number. And then you're going to begin the process of transferring the funds from your account into your bank account. So number two, transferring the funds. So when I got to my account, it showed $5,938. And I was like, yes. So I immediately went to transfer the whole thing into my bank account. And then I, was found, I found out that there's a, a limit of $5,000. So I initially thought that was a daily limit, but I went ahead and I transferred the $5,000. And then the next day I went and I tried to transfer the 938 and no such luck. Then the next day I thought, well, certainly it's been a full 24 hours. And I tried again, no such luck. And they said, call the number on the back of the card. So I called the number on the back of the card and they said, um, it's a one week limit. So you can only transfer $5,000 in a week. So then today, this morning, as I was writing the article uh, about this topic, I went to my account. And as you can see here, um, all you do is you go to where it says transfer under my money. And you, you click on that. And you can see here also, last week I transferred the $5,000, right? And then you make the transfer and boom, it went through. And then you can see here it says you have successfully submitted your funds transfer request and it is being processed now last week it only took a day they say it could take you know two to three days but i did it on monday and the funds hit my bank account on tuesday so that's the process here in california number three how do you get more money uh from the unemployment department 
Well, you want to stick really close to uh, your the website in your particular state. You see, with the PUA money, they initially just gave everybody the minimum. So in my state, the minimum is $167 per week, but the maximum is $450 per week. And if you look at your website, um, this one in California, it says that we will be able to prove that we earned over around $18,000 and then um, we're going to be able to move that money from 167 up to 450. Now you may think, well, that's not not a whole lot of money, but if you look at this little uh, line I made in an Excel spreadsheet, you can see that from February 9th, which was the first week of my unemployment, through May 9th, which was the end of last week, that's 13 weeks. The difference is 283 per week. So when we take 13 weeks times 283. That's another th almost $3,700. So that's pretty significant. So then the question becomes, when are we going to be able to certify that we've made enough money, you know, met the threshold to get the maximum amount? In California, they're now saying in the media that it's going to be May 20th. Each state is going to be different. So what you're going to want to do is stick close to your website. And if you're not getting the maximum amount and you think you're entitled to it, Find out when they're going to allow you to provide either 1099s or they may ask for tax returns. It's not really clear yet what they're going to ask for because they haven't made any updates, um, at least here in California. Again, every state is going to be different, so you just stick to your, your website, but that's a lot of extra money. That's $3,700. That If I take that $3,700 plus another $1,500 that I'm going to get, well, actually, I would get another $2,000. That would be almost close to over $5,500, right? That's that's crazy. <laughs> I could get another fifty-five hundred dollars dumped into my bank account um, at the end of at the end of this week um, if if I can get things um, you know uh, certified. So that this is all really good news, right? Uh, it's taking a long time. It's been three months, but things are starting to move. So number four, how much money so far? So I made a little uh, little tiny spreadsheet, and as you can see here. Uh, it's okay, right? On April 24th, I got a stimulus check for $1,200. Uh, a few days later, I got this surprise $1,000 dropped into my account. That's for the EIDL. I know a lot of you out there got that money. And then uh, last Monday, I was able to transfer $5,000 from my uh, unemployment. And then uh, today, I transferred another 938 which brings my total to $8,000. $138. So if I play my cards right and I'm able to certify this week and get my amount from 167 to 450 and then they pay me for the next two weeks, that means I could put in another $5,500. That will be significant. That'll take my total to close to $14,000 um, over the last uh, three months. So things are starting to move. And for that, I am, I am really grateful. So what are the key takeaways? Well, two months ago when I started making these videos, it seemed like we were just going to have this money raining on us. It seemed like we had the EIDL. We thought it was going to be 10000 Then the PPP. thought that was going to be 20000 And then we had the stimulus money. And then, uh, and then all this unemployment money. Well, as it's all shaken out, what? We've got some money from uh, the stimulus, we got a thousand for the EIDL, and the unemployment is coming through. So it's taken a long time, but it's nice to see that it's actually starting to, to, pro to process. Some states got their money sooner than we did here in California, and some states are still in the, in the application process, believe it or not. So just stick to your website. The money's there. You know, we live in America. It's all backed by the government. So just keep, you know, keep on top of it. And uh, you know, eventually it'll it'll get into your into your account. So that's it. Hey, thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, give it a like. That'll allow more people to, to see it. Uh, congratulations if you got your debit card um, and you've been able to move your funds to to your uh, bank account out of your unemployment account into your into your bank account. Um, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet to our channel. We put out at least five videos a week, all for drivers and uh, sign up for notifications because that way when we do a live 
a YouTube live, you'll be notified and you can uh, check in and uh, ask questions and just see what's the latest that we know about. All right, y'all go out and have a great day and be safe out there. Bye for now.